Hey guys, welcome to my new video of my Krypton series where I look at the world of Superman and Krypton. Today we explain why Ultraman is Superman's most formidable enemy. But wait, there are multiple versions of Ultraman. The Crime Syndicate of America version or Thunderers, the Earth 3 version, there is also the Elseworlds version from the Nail. However, our Ultraman is Clark Kent from the Antimatter Universe. So, what's his origin? As you well know, Christ is an infinite Earth's established the existence of the Antimatter Universe. A universe parallel but opposite to the DC Multiverse. That is where Antimatter arose to conquer the Positive Matter Multiverse. But what does that have to do with the post crisis continuity? After crisis on infinite Earths, the five remaining Earths were merged by the Matter into one single Earth called New Earth. From there, there was one single DC Universe, one shared history, no more multiverse. Or so we thought. It turns out that the multiverse survived in some form, even the Antimatter Universe. That is where Ultraman comes from. A well respected and famous astronaut on his antimatter Earth, he was saved from a fiery accident in space by aliens. Unfortunately for him, they experimented on him and turned him into a living car battery running on gas on anti kryptonite. Essentially, while Superman needs the sun to power him, Ultraman needs to get high on anti kryptonite to get his superpowers. And before that, he married Lois Lane who turned out to be none other than the Amazon Superwoman. High on his superpower, Ultraman decided to conquer his Earth. He gathered out the superpowered beings namely Owl Man, Power Ring, Superwoman, and Johnny Quick to form the Crime Syndicate of America. What a mouthful. Surprisingly, the popular city contend with the subjugation and did not oppose the CSA. However, proving the, to be the true champion of the oppressed on the anti-matter earth, Lex Luthor opposed the crime syndicate. Successfully, he traveled to the DC Universe and met with the Justice League. But they were not successful in permanently dealing with the syndicate, the League did cause the populace to question their rule over time. So, that's how the multiverse reared back into the DC Universe. But what about Ultraman? What makes him Superman's most formidable foe? That's these five reasons why. Number 5. Antimatter Universe Since he comes from the Antimatter Universe, Ultraman is Superman's opposite. It has been said that Captain Marvel is Superman's equal. Well, Ultraman is the analog to Superman who is his opposite. Number 4. Anti-Kryptonite Anti-Kryptonite powers Ultraman. With his enhanced physiology, he is Superman's match in every way, though opposite. Though Kryptonite is lethal to Superman, it is unclear what the effects of anti kryptonites are. In Jerry World War III, Superman absorbed the anti sunlight from Magadon's anti sun, shutting it down. Though anti sunlight initially crippled Superman with mental anguish. Number 3 Greed. Ultraman is a gangster. Indeed, he will go to any lens in order to get money, literally, even making a deal with the devil. In Final Crisis Superman Beyond One, Ultraman joins the cause of Man Drag in order to get the ultimate prize, money. At the end of Final Crisis, Ultraman is turning into a vampire. And by Man Drag, he withstands the concentrated blast from the Superman of the multiverse. Impressive, huh? Number 2. Positive Matter vs. Anti Matter. In Final Crisis Superman Beyond One, we find out that in Limbo, Superman can't fight Ultraman at all. That the positive matter and anti-matter particles would collide, annihilating each other. This is also the basis of Superman's most powerful version today, the Thought Robot. And then last but not least, number one, Crime Syndicate. Ultraman is the unquestioned boss of the CSA. Though Armin would have something to say or something about that. Thanks to the Syndicate, he rules Earth through fear and intimidation. Due to the differences between the DC Universe and the Antimatter Universe, Antimatter Earth actually seems to accept their tyranny. There you have it. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and follow us on Facebook and Twitter.